Hi everybody, it's Dr. Britt here from Errol Street Chiropractic. Today I'm going to chat to you guys about what the difference between tennis elbow and golfer's elbow is. So if you're someone who has been a little bit confused about what the difference is, stick around as I'm going to answer your questions. So what exactly is golfer's and tennis elbow? Contrary to the name, you don't actually have to play tennis or golf to suffer from these conditions. What they are is overuse injuries. So if you're someone who does a lot of repetitive movements every day, whether you work um, doing a lot of heavy manual labor or you work in front of a computer and you do the same type of movements over a prolonged period of time, this can create inflammation in the tendons that attach into the elbow. So a lot of the time, if you are someone that is suffering from this elbow pain, it is due to that repetitive nature of your day-to-day -day routine. But sometimes it can also come from some trauma or an injury as well. So how do you know if you've got tennis elbow or golfer's elbow? So with tennis elbow, we see that the pain is on the outside of the elbow and with golfer's elbow, the pain is on the inside. And what we find is that it's quite tender to touch if on the outside if you have um, tennis elbow, but it can also be quite tender on the inside if you have golfer's elbow. So that's a good way to first distinguish which side of the elbow your pain is coming from. But the confusing thing is that the pain often for both of them comes down the forearm and it can come into the hand and can also create a weakness um, in terms of your movement or being able to grip things as well. So that sometimes can be a bit confusing as to which one you are suffering from. A great little test that you can do is determine which movements aggravate your pain. So with tennis elbow on the outside, extending your wrist and spreading your fingers will aggravate the pain. With golfer's elbow, flexing your wrist and curling your fingers can aggravate the pain. And that's a good way to test which side of the elbow your inflammation is and where the pain is coming from. So if you are somebody who's thinking, gosh, this sounds exactly like the pain I'm experiencing, then give us a call to have a chat about how further assessment may help you. Or if you're listening to this and thinking, oh, I have a family or friend who is experiencing this pain, then pass this video along to them. And if they have any further questions, tell them to reach out as well. We always love to hear from you guys. So if this video has brought up any questions or you would like further information, don't hesitate to contact us. And bye for now. We'll talk soon. Bye.